Hello everybody, Ray on the Hunter Game Store, let's play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we uh, started some start of the Mining Ranch quest, and they're gonna go, now we're going to go to the, full, the ocean and get something, because I'm going to get this out of the way and get it done now, so... However, we will not be using that mask for anything right now. Now, depending on where you are, um... This, this thing is ra randomized. It depends on where you are. This is randomized, so yeah. Yeah, I, did, I didn't know that, there, that, that this was a Smash Brothers stage of Melee until I actually played this game, so... Until I played this game, I didn't know that this was a thing of Smash Brothers, so... Let's go ahead and swim over here now. And there's some seagulls flocking around very suspiciously up there, so let's go ahead and see what this is all about, huh? Somebody, please get 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 me to shore. Okay. So let's push this Zora from behind, which is really awkward. Um, we're, we're going to push this Dora to the shore. And then as soon as we get close enough to the shore, there'll be a cutscene that starts. So let's go ahead and then let him walk over here. He looks like a zombie. <laughs> Man, you don't look so good. Um, are you okay, man? <sighs> I'm... Mikau, Mikau, I'm a cow of the Zora people, guitarist in the Zora band. I think this is it for me. My final message. Will you listen to it? Yes. Uh, what? Uh, what? One, two, three! Oh, baby, baby, listen to me. The carnivals we're getting soon were the ones that are waiting to see. But that girl, with the girl, that girl I was like, she laid some strange eggs and she has lost her voice. Can you hear what she's, you can't hear what she says. Whoa, whoa, in Great Bay now, there's something happening. Is, in, 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 is it now? Oh, baby, listen to me, I don't want to beg. The, 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 the group of pirates, they stole that girl's eggs. I want to stop the, the Gerudo pirates. But then, pow, and bam, I got knocked down, and here I am. Baby, if I die like this, even if I die, I won't be, be in peace, that's for sure. Somebody, please rescue her aid before the pirates take their toll. Oh, oh, somebody, please heal my soul. That is all. Uh, okay. I kind of just was able to play guitar just fine, and then fell, and then fell right over. He said heal his soul, so obviously that means play the, play the song of healing. So let's do that, and let's listen to this cutscene.
And we got the my most favorite transformation mask in the game, which is the Zora Mask. This this mask contains the spirit of a legendary tourist. Wear it and wear it the wear the mask within the with C and then inhabit the body of Zora by pressing C again to return to normal. Carve my farewell song on my grave. I'm depending on you to help that singer girl. Well, buddy, you're gonna have to wait because I still have stuff I need to do before I can start this area. So, yeah. But anyways, I will go ahead and show off the Zora mask. I know I said I wasn't going to, but I'm, I will. Well, wow, that was quick. Link, you really have the skill. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, equip the Goron, the Zora mask. Let's put it on! Did you know? Why the heck not? This is my favorite mask in the, in the, in the game. Well, my favorite transformation mask. Well, second favorite transformation mask. There is one that is much cooler, much better later on. Now, you can't ride Epona as, a, as, a, as any of your transformation forms. Deck scrub's too small, the Gron's too heavy, and honestly, her back is not big enough to hold a Zora. But this is how the swimming works. If you press R, you can do a quick spin. And then there's like, yeah, there's plenty of stuff around here that you can do, that you can do. So, but we are going to go ahead and I'm going to swim up here to the top. You can also dive and walk in the bottom of things too if you press the B button. But, for now I'm going to take off the mask because we have no need for it. Because we aren't going anywhere quite yet with the, with that revolves the Zora mask, so. Let's go ahead and climb up here. And then we're going to go ahead and Take our bow. We're gonna shoot Tingle out of the sky if I can find him. Tingle, where are you, buddy? Tingle, Tingle, where are you? Ah, there you are. Hi, Tingle. Let's go ahead and shoot you out of the sky. Boom. I don't know how you get how you survived a landing like that, but okay. All right, let's go ahead and talk to him now. I get the map of the ocean. Yes, I know. You already met me before. Tingle, blah, blah, blah. Yes, I know. You're Tingle, blah, blah, blah. I'm nothing like you have a fairy, blah, blah, blah. And you want to buy maps? Yes, I would like to buy Great Bay. Blah, blah, blah. Yuppie. And there we go. We got the great map of Great Bay. Red Arrow's now can find a way around the ocean like we need to find a way around the ocean. Um, but yeah. Alright, Tingle, Tingle, Loompa. I stole your words. I don't really give a fuck. Alright, so, um... So now we have a map of this area, <clears throat> and but more importantly, we have more of the map revealed on our map screen. So this is what Termia looks like so far. So we got Great Bay, we got another random area. So in this area over here will be a very important one later on. The one that's still clouded will be the one the important one later on. But let's just go ahead and make our way back across. I'm going to just use the Zora mask. It's quicker to swim back over to the shore. Just going to swim back over the shore as quickly as possible because I want to get back on the opponent and we want, I want to head back to to Lon Lon Ranch. Or not Lon Ranch, or Monty Ranch rather. Because we had to do that quest still. So... I'm going, to I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the Ocarina for now. I mean, I can just warp over there and make it quicker by myself, but I don't think I will. Because, you know, why not? Okay, so let's go ahead and, uh, I'm going to go ahead and actually do the song right now that I need to do to get to do this our part. So, let's go ahead and go ahead and fast forward to a day, half a day in time. Let's go ahead and fast forward a day ahead in, in a day of time. In the day of time? In a time of day. All right, and let's go ahead and do the night of the first day, yes. And then let's go ahead and play the... Let's go ahead and play the inverted song of time and, take, and turn the speed of the time back to normal. It's going to take forever if we don't, so... But well, I will slow back down again once we, have a, once we get ready to do the quest. Um, I want to do that, not not do it. I am going to do three episodes, though. I just say I did. I have decided I'm going to do three episodes. Yes, to return to return nine flow to normal. Okay, so now the time is back to normal. 
Where is Epona? There she is. Okay. Now, I'm not sure if we go faster when we're on top of Epona with our bunny hood on. But I have a feeling we are or aren't. I don't know. But, um... Yeah, so... Um... Okay, that's not the right way I need to go. One of these places is actually a Swamp Skull House, which we are going to do right now. Uh, the Ocean Skull House, sorry. And that one's for something special that will get us um, a mask that we need to finish the game, so... There is a couple masks we're going to need to get to finish the game, so... There's also one more mask I want to get, but I will I will go back for that one later when I get ready to go to the when I actually get ready to do the area. You can't touch me because I'm on top of a horse. You do know that, right? The swamp is still poisonous because we because since we went back in time, we never technically took care of the swamp poison, swamp water. But yeah, so we have a lot we need to do. The opponent just got stuck on the wall, which is very tedious. Quick getting stuck on things, Epona. Thank you. Alright, so we're going to head back to Romani Ranch, which is this way. I don't know why I went past that tree. Sorry, so now since we're going back to Romani Ranch, we can do that little thing that we need to do later on. There's also something we need to do tomorrow night on Dawn of the Second Day, on Night of the Second Day, so... There's only nothing we can do on Dawn of the Second Day right at the moment. Right at the moment. And I'm going to save the Andrew and Cafe side quest for last. I mean, I will have to start it in order to get a certain mask, but, um... Yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Let's make our way to the barn and just... I guess I'll just talk about my upcoming projects. So, coming up uh, soon, I'm going to re-record Super Mario World. Well, I'm going to continue Super Mario World. I mean, I have to um, finish it, but... Um, but the upcoming projects I'm going to do will be Dynasty Warriors, obviously, because I, I just said that in the last episode. And I know that's kind of uh, weird, considering that I don't really, I shouldn't really do Dynasty Warriors. But um, I think I'm going to, simply because I, it's very easy. But that's if I can find... Let's see if I can find what I need, or if I can find a version that does not take up too much space on my computer. Because it's like 8 gigabytes of space. So I'm going to need to um, download it, and then just copy it over to my company's files over separately. So, yeah, I'm going to have to do it that way, probably. Because my, my, my game seems to get confused whenever... Um, my computer seems to get confused whenever I try to upload a huge file and say that it's too big, but it's not. Especially if, even if it's on my D drive, it still says that. Um, and also, I don't. I'm still gonna. I'm still planning on redoing Twilight Princess. Hyrule Warriors will be recorded once I get a capture card. That will be nice to record. I'm gonna play it obviously on my own first, though, so I know where everything is. Because I am gonna try to get all all the hard containers in that level and all in that game and all the skulls and yeah. And if I ever I could, if ever I can find the right thing, I could probably download characters from the 3DS version of the store. But I'm gonna have to use my card for that, which I don't know how long that will take. But um, yeah. <sighs> da -da -da -da. I'm, it takes forever to start this quest. But yeah, the, the, but the, uh, the, the, and we had to do it for a, a, a five hours after it appears at 10 o'clock. Well, three hours, technically. Technically three hours because it will appear at 10 o'clock. But I'm going to slow time down when that time comes around. So. But, um, yeah. I'm going to have to go back and get those Skultula, uh, those, those stray fairies from the, from the thir third dungeon. I haven't, from the second dungeon. I'm going to have to go back and do that because... I kind of failed at that, and I'm going to get all the stray fairies in the next dungeon that's coming up too, but we won't be in the next dungeon. Well, probably going to be starting the next area until like two episodes from uh, from now. Not counting the episode I'm, record I'm going to be recording after this one, so... Uh, perhaps I should have just recorded maybe a little... Maybe I should have re started recording it 
like separately in a separate video, so it won't take me that long. But I can deal. So yeah, I just um, I am just doing this right now because I want to get these quests out of the way. Now there is a one more mask we're gonna, we're gonna get. Uh, I'm gonna get, get get that mask after I get done with this. There's two more masks we can get. I'm gonna get the one of them after we get done with this part. But I will end up the episode by then because it'll probably be past 20 minutes by the time I uh, probably 25 minutes from it, almost past almost 25 minutes by the time I finish this. So it's 12 o'clock. All right, Can you go any faster time? I wish there was a way. I wish there was a way you could speed up time, like a song that lets you speed up time a little bit so you can get to areas you want to get to quicker. But there is really no way to speed up time. There really isn't. So. But, okay, it's one. It's now almost 1 o'clock. Alright, 1 o'clock. Now, let's, we need to wait one more hour. Right? Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Um, I will be doing other games that, that, that I can do at some point. I'm going to be doing Ghostbusters, the video game, at some point, whenever I get myself my own PlayStation 3 and a uh, controller and a capture card. Because I know I tried to record it one time on my old channel, but I had to use like, my camera, which... It was really loud, so I had to turn it down. But now I don't have to worry about that, so. But yeah, so let's go ahead and get on top of Epona and get ready for this because, well, first of all, I'm going to slow time down once it hits 2 o'clock. So, once it hits 12 o'clock, once it hits 2 o'clock, I'm going to slow down time. And, okay, let's slow down time. So let's do that and just go ahead and uh, all right, there we go. Let's slow time down. The reason why I'm slowing time down is because these guys move super fast whenever you whenever you have it at normal speed. So and and I want to make sure I do this the first try and I have to redo it because if you fail this, you have to redo it. So there's no way around it. Plus, this empty bottle also helps us with the thing we need to do. Oh, there she is. Hi, Ramani. And you walked right through my horse. And you're walking around my horse. Okay. I thought you walked right through my horse for a moment there. All right, so let's get ready. I'm going to have to wait. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to stay in this spot as much as possible. All right, and it's 1230. It will start. So now we got a cutscene that's going to appear here in any moment now. <coughs> so once it hits 2.30, we will be doing this. Now, time will be much slower, but if they're going to move super fast, then it's going to take for, uh, it's going to be hard for them to, you know. Now, this is going to be a little bit past the time I want to do it. But I guess I should do long episodes, considering that I won't be doing things for a while. Okay, here they come. So let's go ahead and get our... Let's go ahead and get, let's go ahead and get our bow ready and start shooting these guys down. So there's a dog here that will help us out. So whenever a character, whenever a alien starts to get close enough, the dog will start barking. And when that time comes, you have to follow where the dog is and then shoot that dog and then shoot that that one ghost. So this guy right here, he's done. All right. So now that guy's done. Okay, so this guy might is closer now. So this guy's dog's barking at. Now these guys move super fast across the field if you don't have time slowing down. That's why I would really strongly recommend that you have time slowing down when you do this because if you don't, you're going to have a hard time. So This dog is on our side will help us, so Wherever the dog is barking, that means a, a, a ghost or alien or whatever they are getting really close, so. Oh, by the way, as for Banjo Kazooie, we'll get back to that at some point. Um, it's just I died, so I didn't want to have to start the whole level over again. But, um. If I was to have the 3DS, if I had the three, Xbox 360 version, I wouldn't have to worry about it, but I don't have the Xbox 360 version, so.
Now, Banjo Tooie is my favorite Banjo Tooie game, simply because there's bosses. Hopefully, I can get better at the boss fights, because I've been sucking at the boss fights in that game recently when I went back to play it for fun. So, this guy's getting pretty close. I'm going to go ahead and shoot him. Now, these guys will hurt you if you get too close to them, so... Now, you don't have unlimited arrows here, so you have to be careful about how many arrows you use. So, I'm going to go ahead and go run through the grass over here and get some more arrows real quick. Or rather, I'm going to come over here. I need to get more arrows. I can find them. I think these guys do drop arrows for you, though, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and just continue defeating them. Alright, so what's the closest guy now? Dog? Where are you? Okay, the closest guy would be the guy right ahead of us. So let's go ahead and shoot this guy down. Boom, he's gone. And this guy right here. This guy right here. If they get to the barn, you fail, so make sure you don't make sure you know what you're doing. Now there's a there's gonna be a there's, the ghost gonna, over here is getting pretty close, so I'm gonna need to take this ghost out. Otherwise he's gonna get to the barn, I'm gonna be in trouble, so. He drop arrows for me, did he drop arrows for me? I don't think he did. No he didn't. I'm running out of arrows, this isn't good. So I still have a little bit longer to go, so. So where's the arrows at? Oh, there's some arrows. Got him. Alright, got him. Yeah, you can walk right through them, but if you get anywhere near them when you're off your horse, you will get hurt, so. Who's he barking at now? Where's the dog at? Dog barking over here? Yes, he is. Okay, so this guy's getting pretty close then, since the dog's barking. So basically, we have to, we have to, just have, we have to go to like 5 o'clock, so, or 5.30, I believe, it's 5.30. So, now you could stay on top of the roof and snipe them that way, but I prefer to use a Pona because it's easier to get around the map, it's easier to get around the map and take care of these things when you have a Pona. But he's gone. Alright, so. This guy's getting pretty close. And this guy's getting pretty close. Alright, so there we go. Who's the dog barking at now? The dog is barking at this one back here. Okay. So, as soon as it hits 5 o'clock, we are done. So, for 5.30. I'm not sure if it's 5 o'clock or 5.30, but I do know it's one of those times that we will... I'm going to take this guy out while we're at it because I feel like I should. Um, that guy's dead. Alright, so pretty much we're just worried about, I'm just worried about killing these guys, so. Pretty much the focus is just to kill these things. Alright, it's about 4.30. The dog is barking at this guy, so I gotta take him out. I don't think so. That guy, that guy back here is, is getting close again. Alright, so this guy is getting close again, and boom, he's done. Alright, so then we're gonna go to dawn of the second day after this, and then and we're gonna go to night of the second day, because there's actually a thing we can do. Two masks we can get, so. And then I think we will go on to the next area, maybe. I know, we're gonna swap Skull House next, I think. Alright, so. About done here. So it's just about done here. Okay, come on. This thing is gonna be on my nerves. You're dead. Okay, good. 
Alright, so which ghost is get, which which ghost is getting closest now? That one over there, dog? Okay. So that one's getting closer. The barn. I went behind this area, so now I'm gonna have to come back out. So let's kill that guy. And that guy. And then come back here, because I do not want to fail this, so. We're about done. As soon as it hits five something, we're about done, so. Alright, so. Let's go ahead and shoot this guy. If I can reach him, that'd be nice. Excuse me, game. Excuse. Thank you. No, kill this stupid ghost. Thank you. Where's that dog barking at now? He's gonna be barking. Over there. So this guy over here is getting close. Alright. He's barking behind there again, which means that dog over here, which means that. Which this guy over here is gonna be getting close again. And we are done! So there we go. So 5 15. So about 5 15. We did it! We won! Thank you! Thanks to you! The cows are giving thanks to. Here, here's 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 Romani's. Thanks. When you take when you drink it, put your hand on your hip and take a big gulp. Down like we do here at the ranch. We got bottle milk bottle. That's not important. What we mostly got it recovers five hearts. But the most important thing is that we got an empty bottle. So yeah, it's almost time for my sister to, to get up. So I have to get back to bed. See you later. Little hero. Okay. So let's go ahead and go to. Let's go ahead and go to Dawn of the Second Day, and then we're going to talk to Rom Romani's sister, actually. Which I forgot what her name was. And we're going to talk to her, actually, though, and we're going to figure out what she's doing. Let's go ahead and go over here and talk to Romani, sister. Wait, no, we're going to have to go to the barn. Duh! We have to go to the barn. You're an idiot, Rhaegar. Okay, we have to go to the barn. We have to go to the barn. So, that's what I meant to say. We have to go into the barn, not the house. So, let's go into the barn and see what she says. Oh my, hello. Romani's going to take our milk to the cat clock town. You're looking after the place. The cows will be all alone with otherwise. Yes, sister. I'm going to I'm going by wagon to the town. Would you like a ride? You leave at six we're leaving early about six o'clock. This is this evening. So you can join me if you'd like. Alright, we can do that. So, what you want to make sure you do, though, is make sure you don't, I repeat, you don't miss the thing. Because if you miss the thing, if you miss the time, you will have to, you won't be able to do it. So, we're going to go ahead and go. Now, this will be for, the, this will be for our mask, so. But we will do that in the next episode. So, thank you all for watching this episode Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Next time, we will start, we will do this other quest for Normani Ranch, and then we will, we will go ahead and get two more masks. So if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, and if you really like it and want to help my channel grow, please subscribe. Also, make sure you don't forget to leave your comments down below. Let's bring it 100, saying getting 20% cooler. Signing off, peace out.